So obviously Thanos whooped the boo boo. Oh, another thing too. I don't know if you remember in Avengers when uh, Cap, Thor, and Tony first meet up. They fight. They have that fight in the forest, and they're just like, yeah. like dragging each other out. Now, what do you know? The three main ones to fight Thanos before they get whooped, obviously. Yeah. It's Tony, oh, Cap, yeah, right. and Thor. I didn't even notice so that, I don't know no. if that was on purpose, but if it was, what a cool callback to like, that hey, was sick. we're going yeah. full circle. Oh my gosh, what's going? Ah, oh, answer later. Um, but seeing that, I thought that was so cool. Yeah. Um. Oh, dang, I had a thought in my head. Uh, what was this? Uh, okay, come back the callback of them three back, coming back. Three coming back. <laughs> oh, man, I just lost it. Oh, so much knowledge in my head right now. Um, but, I mean, I maybe will come back. But anything else that you were like, oh, like, what? Just. I don't know, bro. So much. So much. Yeah, <laughs> so much stuff happening. If I remember now, I'll probably remember later. But, like, it's just so, so many good things that I fucking love from that movie, bro. And I've only seen it once. Yeah, this, right. this is the only thing I like. These are the yeah. things that stood out to me the most that I remember. Uh, damn, how about you, Danny? You haven't. You, that, you yeah, anything, even know anything before though. we dive deeper into it? Yeah. <laughs> you guys mentioned almost everything. No, but you're like, do you have any personal before we kind of close it up after the battle? Any personal? Any what? <laughs> any or about a favorite moment that you had? They thought was cool. Oh, that, that was, was sad. pretty sad. We'll get to that later on in a bit. <laughs> not yet, not yet. Oh, I also liked uh, Captain Marvel when she came in last minute. Destroyed oh! the whole ship, bro. The whole ship just... Oh, OP. Is she overpowered? Maybe just a little bit, but it doesn't matter because she came in and hooked it up. Um, And then how they all assembled all, all the girl heroes. Oh, you know, that's based on a real comic book. Thing. Oh, yeah. My brother told me the that. The A Avengers or something like that. Yeah, when it's all, all women, right? Yeah. I was like... Mm. That was cool. Mm. Mm. I don't like her haircut though. I gotta say that. I don't like it. I don't like. It. I like. I, I prefer her with the long. But hair. I like. I like how they kind of call that out when yeah. Rocket is like, "What are you gonna get another haircut?" I was like, oh, okay, I was. I like that. That was funny. Um, oh, the that was a cool scene though. He came back, but I lost it again. <laughs> oh my gosh! No, because it was about how right before you think, um, right when um, Cap, you think, oh, he's about to get whooped. Thanos is there. Um, ah, oh, dang, I lost it, dude. I, yeah, I really lost it. Whatever. But I guess moving on. But yeah, it's funny because, I mean, and some people are like, oh, why wasn't Captain Marvel there though at the whole movie? Well, think about it. I mean, obviously, because they don't, if they're, like, movie wise, if she's there with them, they're going to easily do what they have to do. She's like, again, she's OP. She's yeah, cosmic. Bro. She, has she got hit by Thanos. She just went, she's like, yeah, head she's, she's like, like I got not phased, dog. I was like, <laughs> okay. She ate that point. So it makes like sense. It but nothing. I like the clever way they kind of made it seem like we're just not going to include her, but they give a reason why. And she said in the beginning, too, it's like, oh, how come you don't, like, well, like, what are you doing? She's like, oh, there's other, or even, there's two scenes where she says, not every planet has the Avengers. Yeah. That's one. And the second, she's like, everyone else is going through the, the same, same thing, thing as you guys. Yeah. So titles together, they don't have Avengers. They're suffering. Governments are suffering. People are suffering. Who else better to help them than Captain Marvel? Who because was it was capacity? the whole universe, right? Yeah. The snapped. whole, yeah. It was we're just we're talking about full planets. Which is why she even said, I'm not coming back for a while. But luckily, she got the memo and came through she clutch. She showed up, bro. She showed up. She destroyed that shit. She like it was boom, nothing, bro. I was like, oh. Um, but that was cool. I thought that was awesome. Uh, I think that's what they say. I just love, I love that chant, dude. But um, maybe want to see Black Panther again. But what's it called? Yeah, just so, yeah, it's just so cool. And then, um, that scene when Tony asks, "Hey, you said one in fourteen million, right?" Oh. is this the one he's like if i tell you what it is yeah it, it, won't, won't, happen. it won't happen i was yeah. like pardon me that's when i started like Tony, and then he signals he signals him bro at the end he's just like <laughs> i was like, like oh, oh it's gonna happen <laughs> the inevitable so then that happened and um but he was gonna take it off though i didn't expect him to just take off when he went like this i was like yeah. okay. i thought he was gonna take maybe one away oh and then he's like make it a little powerless mm -hmm. but then he like, he, oh, oh, and then his whole thing just transformed i was like yeah oh, dang. And, and you know what's crazy is like that's funny why didn't these do that in all the other in the other one how they're like they're trying to take off the gauntlet but maybe we could have just taken off the the, the stones <laughs> <laughs> the whole plan was like Argh! yeah but, yeah that whole sequence when again yeah people forget thanos is a titan he's like he's a beast bro 
He's oh my gosh. And he does. Oh, he says his line, Iron Man. I am Iron oh, Man. Oh, okay. So yeah, let's let's get to that then. We'll close up the battle and we'll move on to, yeah, to the yeah, next man. thing. Um, yeah, he's like, I am inevitable, and then boom, and you're like, oh, wait a minute, what's happening? And then bam, the stones light up Tony's arm. But you you already have an idea. Damn, it's gonna happen. Um, but yeah, I what a way to close it. I am Iron because I mean. That's how he finishes the first movie. Yeah, yeah, remember the, the press conference? Um, yeah, the press conference. He, He's, he has the cards. Yeah. He, uh, oh, the mic. Oh, my bad. Um, yeah, he ends with, I am Iron Man. And it's like, oh, what a way to, to kind of close this his chapter. Um, but yeah, I was like, dang, dude. And then that whole snap, the whole thing. And then, like Edward said, yeah, Daniel's kind of the G. Down, bro. He bro. just sits down. And he's like, all right. That's it. You guys got me. And that's yeah. it. <laughs> but yeah, and then. Oh, how come I? One moment, uh, when Wanda, Scarlet Witch, she almost pretty she can pretty much kill Thanos. Hadn't it been for the? Oh yeah. When it says rain fire, she's literally like. You took everything from me. Who are you? you? (laughs) And she said, "You about to find out." And I was like, "Wow," because I feel like we've never. I mean, we've seen to an extent how powerful she can be. But I think this one highlighted like oh, yeah, she could take she's, Thanos. She bro. knows her power. She knows her capabilities, and she, yeah, she almost does. Like pieces of his arm was coming off. It was gonna happen, but then yeah, we'll see. Call rain fire, and then that brought in my homie Cap Marvel, and then that whole sequence happened, and then um, sorry guys, because keep calling me. Hey, Mr. Popular. Hey, guys, and, uh, who? Hey, um, Sorry, it's actually family stuff. You saying we're not family? See how she's trying to be all like, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> you can't. My hair is growing back. I feel powerful again. You can't say nothing. Yeah, it looks nice, bro. It's My hairline nice. is going it's back. Girl, bro. It's looking good, bro. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, this, yeah, it's just this whole movie as a whole, like, what a, like, what a way to close it with this freaking battle. It was awesome. Uh, anything else? Anything else about the battle? Favorite moments? Favorite? Favorite, nah, anything it was, it was cool bro everything is just sick like i don't know what else i could say i guess we'll move on to them so did you have a uh, certain a favorite character from the movie or a favorite character moments that you were like okay cool you don't have to go too deep but just you know favorite character them. from the movie yeah so maybe other than the main avengers somebody on the side who were like oh that was cool that was funny uh Nah, bro, I guess uh, just uh, Falcon, bro. Just because of, uh, you know, he's... On your left? Yeah, bro, that and the ending. Shit. Like, you know, I was just like, ah, oh, yeah, dude. I was like, to dang. Because, um, I mean, Bucky at the end, he knew already. Yeah, he's like, like, as soon as he was leaving. Yeah, he, he knew. They, they, they do that, that, the same thing. Yeah. That, <laughs> he's don't, like, don't be do stupid. stupid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. taking all like, the stupid yeah, with yeah, like, I was like, ah, dude. Something's happening here. Um, Shoot. Uh... You? I'm trying to think. Who you got? Mm, I think... You know who I liked a lot in this movie? Who? Or the the pair relationship was uh, Rhodey and Nebula. How they're on their mission. No, okay. And now she's like, I wasn't always like this. Oh, and right, he's like, right. neither was I. But, you know, you got to do what you, what you have. And I was like... such Because, I mean, a lot of Rhodey or War Machine, as some people know him, is he's essentially like a side to Tony. Who's always... I mean, that's his character too. He's just always in the main frame. But just kind of give him even just a small moment, like or whether it was him saving Rocket, he's like, I can't yeah. be. And he's like, Ugh, being like losing out that that was. I cool. forgot because he lost his legs, huh? Yeah. The, the one in the end when they vision, all fight, yeah, yeah, yeah I remember. Yeah, that. I forget about it. Because yeah, Falcon just like he notices it, he just whoop, he yeah, dips, he tried to save him, boom. Yeah, and then he's like, Tony, I'm sorry, and then Tony blasts yeah, him, just falls, dude, oh, I'll break the wall. Um, but yeah, that's, I mean, I thought yeah, that was cool. Yeah, I guess Nebula too. Actually, I, I liked yeah. her a lot. For a while, I wasn't a big fan of her character, but this movie, yeah, bro, made they me like her. Yeah, they made her a lot nicer. They yeah. give her a different side. Yeah, they give her a, a, like on the an ship. Arc. Yeah, on yeah. the ship too. Like she gives the rest of the food to Tony. She's oh like, you take gosh, it. Oh my gosh! When I saw that, when I, I saw, like, I was like, what Nebula? And they're playing the little game, bro. Yeah. She's like, ah, he's like, good game. And then she good gets game. to see Gamora again. Yeah, her sister. Oh, I man. was like, ah, dude. And there's some people who I've heard are like, oh, why does Gamora just quickly want to help her out? Well, the thing about it, Nebula, again, Nebula's very brainwashed. But Gamora, even if you watch her in Guardians of the Galaxy, she wasn't always 100% with her dad. Yeah. It was very wishy-washy. She was very, like, 
Yeah, because she it's, saw like yeah, the destruction really, of yeah. her family. Bro, you really, like, yeah, half he killed half of her planet. Like and she saw, bro. She like, saw it. So it's like, dude, it's like obviously he raised her, but is is he really who like this grand? Because I remember we when we talked about Infinity War, we kind of understood why Thanos wanted to do what he did. Was it correct exactly? No, I'm not. <laughs> but, but you you can see why his his mind was set on let me do this. I want to solve this situation this yeah. way. So that happened. And then another thing too, people forget, I think this Thanos is much more dangerous than Thanos from Infinity War. Because in that one, like you said, it's not personal. I just have a mission I want to, because I want to save the universe. Yeah. Meanwhile, on this one, he says, you guys are being a pain in my butt. So I'm personally going to enjoy destroying your world. And the rest of this universe. Because he wants his yeah, future. Yeah, because he wants He, wants he saw what it is. He's yeah. like, I know I can achieve it now. So now it's just bloodthirsty. Yeah, and, he's like, I just want to get yeah. there. And he's fit. Nothing, he hasn't been damaged yet. He's ready to go. And it's like... So yeah, people forget this 2014 Thanos. Yeah, because that's where he comes from. Like, And he sees his own levels. death too, bro. Yeah, and he's and like... He's just like, oh, that's destiny. destiny. Yeah, bro. I was like, wow, you're crazy, dude. But I mean, that's... So I guess that's another... I mean, yeah, he's a villain. I mean, one of the... I would say the greatest villain in the MCU. <laughs> but, yeah, what a character too, man. Like, yeah. It's just a, a G, dude. When he just sat down, he just disappeared. He was like, all right, that's that. Um, and even when he was waiting for them three to come down to I fight him, he's like, down. what is he doing? He's just waiting. He's like, all right, let's go. He's like, wow. But, but yeah, let's move on. Um, this is where the waterworks might start. <clears throat> one minute. Um, oh, it's fine. Well, I'm going to just let it go. I might split this one up anyways. One minute. Um, we're not even halfway done. <laughs> no, we just have like this. Yeah. But all right, let's break it down. So yeah, don't worry about time. I'll, I'll fix yeah, it. Yeah, 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 fix it. Because yeah. I think this movie. I mean, because it's the end to a f- like. I mean, no, I know technically phase. I think phase three. Of this movie yeah, is, but I don't, it's, I don't care. About it's that, gonna bro. yeah. This, <laughs> it's gonna end with uh, Spider Man, which I'll explain my theory with that one. With a new Spider Man coming out this year, so after that, it's officially done, and we're gonna start with a new phase four, which maybe we'll know we'll know when it's gonna happen. But yeah, it's, dude, it's 10 years. Do you realize 10 years? 10 years ago, we were... See, we're 23. We were in 8th grade. Yeah, bro. <laughs> we were in middle school. So it's insane to think like, wow. like It's the end of, of obviously, a, a film era or hero era, but also a, a childhood yeah, chapter. Bro. Yeah, because like, these are heroes that we saw. We pretty much saw. grew up, yeah. Like, oh, we shit. finally Robert saw Downey Jr., Jr., Iron Man. Yeah, like Iron Man. Like, who, <laughs> who knew, right? And it was like, wow. Um, But yeah, so let's go to... Uh, so the three main, I guess, every character had their moment, but these three characters officially, their their story came to some form of an end, whether it was death or just, in this case, retirement. Yeah. So let's start with, because she was the first one to go, Black Widow, or Natasha, I forgot to say her last name. Yeah. But, um, but yeah, what do you think about that moment? That whole scene as a whole. That was, yeah. I feel like it was kind of brutal. It was, The way bro. they were just like... Poof, yeah, like, they were going all out. They are like, no, I'm going to die. Yeah, I'm going <laughs> <I'm laughs> to die. I was I'm like, gonna. oh, damn. Oh, damn. No, you gotta go. This is the change. But uh, it was crazy, bro. Yeah, I mean, like when they're both like, wait, I don't think we're talking about the same person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. just like they tussle it out for a sec. For one slight second, I was like, they're gonna, they're gonna try and kill each other. But I was like, no, because you're supposed to lose the loved one. Yeah, like they was, love each other, bro. Like, yeah, they've I mean, been through a lot of a lot of stuff. Yeah, I was like, like he, essentially, he's on because I think if I'm correct in the story, their story, he was sent to kill her. But I think, because uh, I think people forget, I mean, oh, that's another thing, too. Right? Yeah. Hawkeye was is an assassin. Yeah, they're both they're He's both a kill, strain, He's a yeah. trained killer. And, like, uh, when he turns to Ronan with the whole, I'd I say, ninja yeah, Avenger or whatever. Yeah. I forgot to mention that, too. That like, he was just, so good. I just, like. He was <laughs> killing. He was, like, sword now. Sword, yeah. Like, oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Um, using guns too, no? He started using guns too. No, was, oh, no? I don't, I, no, it's just swords. Just in, swords. In the oh, but I mean, okay. it's blows. I mean, yeah. it's the same thing as a damn, damn bullet. But yeah, but to see how, like, she said something like, oh, like, uh, like, oh, like, I've look what I've done, Natasha. Look who I've become. But then he's, she's like, well, you didn't judge me when you found me. And it's like, wow. Like, yeah. Dang, dude. So, I mean, and then for me personally, First off, Scarlett Johansson, I've had a crush on her for a very long time. Um, I think the first movie I saw, I had a crush on her was when she came out in Eight Legged Freaks. I don't know that movie. No, with the big spiders. I no, no. never saw I'll, that I'll show you. I'll show you. The <laughs> you've seen it. But yeah, I forget she came out in that movie. On, and uh, what's it called? Yeah, she was a daughter of one of the characters. So then that happened. 
Uh, but yeah, going back. So obviously I have a crush on, big crush on this actress. But her character too, Black Widow, I think we were just starting to get to kind of know her. Um, but yeah, like we said, yeah, we were just starting to get to know her. And then her whole story, like, which we kind of discovered in Age of Ultron. Yeah. Is how she felt, always felt like a monster. Especially after what, because I think she has something called the Red Ledger. Which is pretty much all the guilt she felt, or representing what all the people she killed as well. Because she, I mean, it's not like she was an assassin for like a year or two. Like, she just grew up to be an assassin. So she's done a lot of killing, a lot of maybe in her mind, pointless murder things that maybe she felt still felt guilty about. So for me, it felt cool to finally see her gain maybe some sort of freedom, being like. Maybe this is my way of making everything right with myself again. Sacri- like she, like they said, yeah. whatever it takes. So and yeah, so I mean it was it sucked because I mean it was awesome, a great moment to see like oh wow like she accepted it, but in her mind you know and at the end it, it helped obviously because yeah, so stone so, so yeah so <laughs> stone. imagine oh uh, that would be awkward but, breaks yeah, it uh. breaks out oh, wait a minute <laughs> but yeah it's just like like dude like um. Yeah, it just it was crazy. It was like, tough, bro. Yeah, actually, I see, didn't know. I didn't know who was gonna die at the end, bro. Yeah, they, at that one yeah. one jump stop, I was like, "That's it, that's he's it, dead." He's and then boom, they true. got him. I was, I was like, like what? "Wow, what is going on?" And she's like, "Let go," and he's like, "No," like, and he still reaches for her, and it's like, "Oh my gosh!" That was like, "Damn, bro." That was tough. I was like, bro. "All right, I should have tear two right now." <laughs> Don't matter. <laughs> just crying, but yeah, that moment. I mean, what a great moment, but it's. It sucks, like I said, we were just. I think, for example, Scarlett Johansson also did an amazing job. Like that scene where Rhodey talks to her about Bart or Hawkeye when she's like all the bodies, this and that, and she's tearing up. Also while eating a sandwich, I thought that was funny. But no, she's tearing up because then at the end, people forget like that. It's her, like her brother, pretty much. Yeah. And it's just like, and like you said, like this is my family. I have no one else. Or like when Red Skull was like uh, Natasha, daughter of Ivan. Oh, yeah, and yeah, he's yeah. like, oh, what? Because he knew your dad's name that he may be right. She's like, I didn't even know his name. I was like, oh, dang, that one got. Because the more background to her, like, yeah. Oh, now man. it's like, dang, she's like, she suffered a lot. Um, but hopefully we get to see that with whatever movie they're gonna make. Hopefully yeah. they do make it. Then it'll just sleep on it and let it go. But, but that's yeah. another reason too. I thought Hawkeye was good at Oh, because of the movie. Because then. of the movie, I was like, oh, yeah. she has to be alive. But I never, it could no, be a prequel. I, I, yeah, I can see it being a prequel. And yeah. Then, but it'd be cool because then we could see Scarlett Johansson back. More of her, her yeah. story. Um, but yeah, let's move on to... Come on, bro. One <laughs> job. And then it's to stay quiet <laughs> over there. Ay, ay, ay. It's probably another vape video again. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> Um. Ah, so let's like, see. Hey, um, to the camera, bro. Just put it in front of. <laughs> We're gonna find it. We're gonna hack into your phone and get it and post it. I already deleted. It'll be one of the one of the videos of the week. <laughs> video of the week, and she's not even gonna know. We'll show Edward. She's like Edward, check this video of the week, bro. Oh, what's that? He cries laughing. Oh, she's like, what is it? I like, just watch it. On just watch it on the episode. On the podcast. Yeah. <laughs> um. Oh, but yeah, let's. Shit. So my waterworks might start here. Hopefully it doesn't. So let's move on to Iron Man. Um, his death. <laughs> oh, oh man, you go first. <laughs> now let me Real relax. Iron Man. Yeah. I don't know, dude. It's crazy. <laughs> it was crazy, bro. He just—he's just on the rock, bro. Half his body destroyed. He had this lifeless look, bro. Like, yeah, and it's just enough to say bye to. Yes, Pepper. bro. And even Spidey and even Rhodey, but. Like <laughs> moment of silence. For yeah, moment of silence. For like <laughs> for Iron Man. Started, um, no, it's just like it was. It was great, bro. It was, it was yeah, good acting, bro. Yes, yeah, I again. I hope like I know comic book movies have kind of made a surge in terms of like award season, and like we saw Black Panther nominated for Best Picture, which is cool. I personally found the award should have gotten it, but it's fine. Whatever, it got the nomination. <laughs> um, it won for Best Costume Design. That was cool. I I knew it was gonna win that one, but. Either way, it's an Oscar award-winning movie. Um, like again, like Heath Ledger won for Dark Knight, which I think was deserving. Fortunately, he passed away by that time already. But even like 
seeing like uh, Spider Man into the Spider Verse winning the Oscar for Best Animated Feature. So seeing stuff like that is like, oh, maybe we're approaching a moment in time where it's okay to see, let's say, uh, Avengers Endgame nominated for Best Picture, which may, on, and honestly won't probably won't be. Because yeah. again, I don't know how it works. I still don't understand yeah, how the Academy, criteria and all that. It's, how they, yeah. it's like, if it's a good movie, it's a good movie. Like, <laughs> That's how you should look at it. <laughs> yeah, it's, if it's good, it's good. Obviously, it's great. So if it's great, it's great. Then it's going to be the but. Yeah, but hopefully, you know, he... Because the way he just... What a performance, bro. Yeah, like his... Throughout the whole movie. Not the end just that, of a not just tenure, that yeah. yeah, just... The end of a 10-year arc, also in the one movie, and it's like... Oh, dang. I'm feeling it. A few tears. Because... And I saw this in a review, and I'm like, that's so right. Because I remember in Civil War, I was Team Cap. And I was like, man, Tony's a butthole. But I was like, at the end of the day, it sucks. Because, like, especially when Pepper says, like, it's okay, like... We're going to be okay. You can rest now. It, it, it was never Tony being selfish or trying to be righteous. He was he was just worried for everybody. He just And it sucks because a lot of people, even fans, were probably anti-Tony Stark. Yeah. Because it was like, oh, he's trying to keep superheroes down. But it's like, again, he was just trying to Look out keep his family, yeah. keep his friends and family safe. And it it's one of those things where it's like, dang, like, it sucks that he had to do what he had to do. In the sense of sacrifice, but he accomplished his mission in the end. He's tired, but now he can rest. The world's fine. There's a new Avengers coming. There's a new team coming. We defeated, and, and obviously in this storyline, the main threat. Yeah. What was what he was so afraid of? Um, but yeah, yeah and it's what a, what a, and I hate it because. Watching the third time, I'm thinking, man, they ain't gonna get me. <laughs> he just break down again. <laughs> but yeah, I saw it. It hits harder every time. Yeah, you watch. And the score and the music that they put, I'm like, ah, oh, you son of a gun, you got me again. Pepper, bro. Oh my god. His daughter, bro, and that hologram that that last oh, goodbye. I love you. I love you three thousand, bro. Oh my. Oh. When I first saw it, when they first showed it, like him in the bedroom, I was like, oh, that's cute. And then he and says then it, and the hologram. Got your heart I was and like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> just when they knew they planted they the seed so much and they more just, meaning bro they don't know. but um but, oh i guess to kind of lighten it up that scene when pepper comes in with her i think her when the comics it's rescue the suit that she wears yeah it's rescue and him and her back to back black oh, yeah. thing, i was like what a freaking po- power couple literally <laughs> name a better duo name a better duo <laughs> dog i don't care who you are um yeah that was so cool and it's I mean, what what a way to to end like again end the chapter for Tony Stark, um, and we'll see who kind of takes his mantle of have them both tech fighting. billionaire fixing everything and then because she she was always against it though right that mm-hmm. whole Iron Man suit and everything Pepper Pepper yeah at one point she was oh, okay. but like in this movie she even says like I know who you are yeah you, you can't stop you're restless if you do like when he says oh I can just oh yeah I could just yeah. it away. And she's like, but are you really going to be resting? Are you really going to be relaxed? And she knew. She's like, come on, dog. And pl- remember, she started off as an assistant. Like, she even said, one of my failures was to keep you from trying or something. Oh, yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, that's so true. Iron Man 1. I remember all those scenes. Um, oh, and then the cheeseburgers. Oh, yeah. And I remember yeah. Iron Man 1 when he came back. He's like, I want cheeseburgers. And I was like, oh, that's what they're talking And the little too. girl. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh, dude. Um, but yeah, let's move on to my to my dude cap. So rest in peace, Iron Man. And it's funny because I keep forgetting that these characters are not real. This is not real life, but because they've I've personally been so into invested it, so involved in, yeah, so in it, so invested, invested into. There you go, that's where yeah. invested. It's like, damn, I might not be seeing. T- I mean, obviously, maybe we're in not going to see it now, bro. No, they might do you never, you know, more <laughs> production <laughs> studios. They, oh, he's a hologram because in the comics, there's something called AI Tony. Oh, really? So it's like kind of like artificial intelligence, but with Tony's yeah, Tony. Yeah, Tony. Yeah, yeah. So he's like he's in a suit walking around, but it's just no body. It's just the AI controlling it. So there's that, but I mean, no, it's not the same. Yeah, it's not the same. But seeing so that, um, so yeah, shout out to my homie TS passed away or CI. No wait, I ain't wrong. CI, um, <laughs> I, I am. There you go, Iron Man. <laughs> um, but yeah, so. But moving on to my my homie Cap, um, what do you think of the way they closed out his? I like I like this ending, bro. It was nice. I was like, he deserves it. He yeah. deserves the happiness, bro. Yeah, that from the get go, from his first movie, I was like, dang. 
Why you 70 so years, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. Coming to a whole new world, bro. Without the love of your life. Yeah, even mm-hmm. though, I mean, there was a whole weird moment with the niece, right. but it doesn't oh, yeah. matter. <laughs> it doesn't but matter. Besides her, though, like, he never, like, went with another girl or anything. Yeah, never. Never. Even, I, I think even then, I think it was, was there. And it was just the kids, though, right? Yeah, it was just the kids. Yeah, right? I yeah. Yeah. Oh, I remember that scene when uh, I think Bucky and oh they're, they're in the like, seat right in the car they're like yeah, yeah. <laughs> I thought that was funny but yeah and like you said like I mean that's the thing about Cap I mean we see him as this leader we see him as a guy who I mean he is what a, like when he gave that speech before they went time traveling in the time heist and then Rock is like wow oh, he's yeah. really good at that right? <laughs> he's like yeah he is I'm like yeah I mean that's just who Cap is and then here's the thing like you kind of see how Cap has matured as well. Like, you, he, he went from being this, like, hey, oh, boy, I'm going to save the day to, like, this is what we have to do to make sure everything everything goes right. And, like, he cusses in the movie as well. We remember, in, I think it was the first Avengers Ultron. He was like, hey, watch your language. It's a Tony. <laughs> He's like, oh. <laughs> uh, so I thought that was cool. But seeing him kind of evolve. But the thing is, what what makes, I feel for me, what makes the ending so, so awesome is, I think people kind of forget that Cap, like you said, is he's like um he's like a man lost in time he's i mean yeah he had his family but at the end he was alone like he like he essentially eventually assimilated to to whatever era and our current era in that case yeah. but it's he it was never home and his home was always with obviously yeah, love with of his peggy life. yeah peggy and it's like whether he showed it or not i mean the only reason he probably was able to hang out was probably because of bucky but even then, that was a whole nother thing. Bucky, a brainwashed terrorist who almost who killed a bunch of people, who then they had to keep safe and then caused the whole rift between the Avengers. And then so, I mean, that wasn't exactly a, a, a great uh, a thing to have from the past. I mean, obviously. <laughs> kind of toxic. End. Yeah, kind of kind of toxic relationship. <laughs> but, I mean, just to see him go back in time and have, like you said, have that life that Tony, Tony said go have it dude like get a life and he finally did and then um yeah and he gave he gave so much he gave everything to the freaking i always put everyone first yeah he put everyone before himself and it's like it's it's (laughs) like um like yeah it's like he he gave everything and i mean what what more can you do other than besides save the universe uh and then again like his best friend whom again they had riffs, his best friend died. And he's like, We both give it all, but like, and I'm gonna do what you pretty much were clowning me to do, but you inspired me to do. And I was go live my life, go home. That's and it, cool, bro. Yeah, and I was like, What a and the song and the way they you closed see him it. sitting down at the bench. I was like, I was oh. like, oh, yeah. Yo, old man, you got me. And then yeah, the passing on of the torch, or in this case, shield to yeah. Sam. Sam. I'm like, what a what a cool moment and and people were kind of like oh why didn't he give it to Bucky? We kind of got to realize I don't know if people exactly want Bucky to be Captain America because mm. remember though Bucky's good now. Uh, yeah. A couple <laughs> movies ago he was blowing up a <laughs> lot of things and killing a lot of innocent people. Yeah. Uh, again he was I know he's brainwashed but still like, I don't think people would want to see like oh this is Captain America an ex terrorist who terrorized our nations around the world or an assassin pretty much new captain america <laughs> yeah or new captain america so it makes sense that he passed on the torch you know sam, sam. next veteran um next no veteran of war yeah. yeah um who's still continuing the good fight with the avengers and so i mean that was cool to see and um but yeah i mean what a, what a way to end it and yeah i guess and he doesn't does say anything about either about his life he's like oh you yeah, want to tell me about like, her like, um no, no i don't think like, I yeah I, I was like, like oh <laughs> smooth a man what is it what is that what's that saying a man doesn't share his kisses what is it how's that phrasing go don't kiss and tell i don't kiss something and tell. it's something like something like that, something like that. i'm gonna google it <laughs> but meanwhile i google this um let's move on to the next thing how i asked edward what do you think is next for the avengers i'll oh, see that i don't know bro Oh, what, I mean, what do you, I'm pretty what? sure there's a lot of like things that the, that can happen. Yeah. Like you said, like in the uh, during the fight scene, they see the the women, you know, get together. Maybe they'll make a movie about that, bro. I mean, I don't know what you guys talk about when you say Phase Four. I'm not really. Oh, I'm, well, I'm just it's like because I think they a collection of films were all, they're all separated in phases. Yeah. So like Phase Three was like the Infinity War phase. Yeah. So like leading up to Thanos and whatnot. And they're saying Phase 4, which is the next run of movies, the next maybe 10 years. Damn, bro. Oh, excuse me. 
next 10 or years, not even of, 10 years of hero years. movies, bro. Yeah. Um, it's gonna, they say it's going to be very space, cosmic, uh, based, like very Guardians of the Captain Galaxy Marvel, with, Guardians, yeah, and, uh, yeah. Yeah, and all that stuff. Um, I can't wait to see that with Thor. Oh, a gentleman doesn't kiss and tell. Tell see, I was kind of yeah, yeah, close. You're, you're on the nose. Oh, oh, what a fail. Oh, nice, 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 nice. nice. <laughs> <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, look, we're so, I mean, well, at least, so even if you don't have an idea of what, what would you want to see in the next Avengers based off of like what, how this ended? Oh, like the next Avengers yeah. movie? Yeah, or yeah, the next Avengers movie, whatever, yeah. What, what, would you, what do you want to see? Even if it doesn't happen. What do I you don't know, see? it's hard because I mean, when I think Avengers, bro, I think Captain America, <laughs> Iron Man, bro, oh, Hulk. Yeah, like, no. I wouldn't know who, who I would want to see in the Avengers movie. You know, yeah. it's, it's hard, bro. Yeah. It's hard, dog. Who would you want to see, bro? Since um, you know more about these heroes. Well, I guess. Well, I mean, in that case, I'll just before I answer, I'll ask you this yeah. then: uh, Who would be your picks for the new Avengers team? I mean, Hulk's got to be there, bro. Yeah, he's, he's got to be the there. brains. The Did man. he get messed up though? Just his arm, but I'm uh, sure it'll heal. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, it'll be a while because that thing was crispy uh, like bacon. Hulk, Hawkeye. I'm pretty sure that was gonna retire. Yeah, I think he's stay like, with his family. Bro. I almost died many an hour yeah. guys. So let me chill. Black yeah. Panther. I want to see him in an Avengers. Oh, maybe even as a leader, bro. I yeah, don't know. I, I even saw something talking about how um, how he could potentially be the new Tony because oh, okay. rich yeah, yeah, yeah. tech and vibranium and overall currency. So I think he could fill that spot in kind of for Tony. Or oh. Sherry, too. His sister be the yeah. new Tony for the team. I wouldn't want to see Captain Marvel in it, though. Why? She's so strong, so bro. So like, any herself. guy comes up, just bah, Boom. that's it. Like, uh, it's oh, over, that's bro. it. It's in the movie. <laughs> Uh, damn, bro. I'm trying to think of all the other people that are in the Avengers. Falcon, of course, bro. I want to see him. Yeah, I'm pretty sure by this time it'll be Captain Falcon. Yeah, he'll don the the red, white, and blue. I'm sure. And uh, what's his name, bro? War Machine. Oh, Rhodey. Yeah, Rhodey. I want to see him in there. I mean, I'm pretty sure he'll be back. Or maybe he's like, oh my gosh. He leaves too. Yeah, he like, that's he might, it. Yeah, he might retire. Spider Man. Yeah, Spidey. I would see him in there. That'd be cool. I think that's pretty much it. I want to see them. Um, I would say Doctor Strange too, but I feel like he's pretty powerful himself already too. Yeah, okay. Even with, with the time Marvel, with the yeah. time stone, bro. It was like I don't um, know. I don't know, bro. Right? Yeah. I mean, man, that's crazy. It's a lot of heroes, dude. <laughs> yeah, there's so many, and I think what's it called? Um, who could be? I mean, for my picks, I would want to see. Oh, for, I guess for the ne- what's next for the Avengers? I I just want to see more Avengers movies <laughs> and good villains. That's all I want. Yeah. Just great films. And then um, for picks, so <laughs> let's say if we were picking, how many were the original six, right? Because it was Hulk, Thor, um, Cap, Tony, Hawkeye. Was it? No, oh, I'm just forgetting. Yeah, Black Widow. So six. Yeah. So let's say if I were to pick six, so Spidey, mm-hmm. um, I think Black Panther, T'Challa. But I don't think he would be the leader, nah. only because he's over here running Wakanda. Yeah, you're right, you're right, you're so right. Kind of be, but I, what I could see is them moving he- Avengers headquarters to, to Wakanda. Wakanda. So I could see that. And that would make so much sense. So him, them two. Um, I think some ladies on this team. I think Scarlet will be back. Yeah, Scarlet Witch will be back. Um, let me get one more lady up in this team. Um, what else is there? There's... I, I would say Captain Marvel, but I feel like she's going to be an Avenger on leave. So, like, if they're getting whooped again. Yeah, they're going to be like, oh. They'll be like, hey, girl. And then, <laughs> come Destroy on. another ship. So, she'll be like a sub. She'll be like the seventh. She'll be in the yeah, bench. Yeah, she'll she's be the that, bench. That, that bench. Just yeah, in yeah. case, bro. We got you. <laughs> hey, yo, I'm getting whooped. <laughs> Flies over. So, I said, I said uh, T'Challa, Spidey, um, Scarlet, Scarlet Witch. Scarlet. Oh, who's another? Maybe... Oh, no, no, no. I was going to say Nebula, but she's with uh, the Guardians. Yeah, she she's with the Guardians. Yeah. 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 I mean, because I know so I've seen some videos where they say Thor coming back, but I think he's kind of just. Uh, yeah, I feel he's going yeah, to make his way to. Yeah, probably, yeah as Guardians. Guardian. Of, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I think that's going to be that. So I, I wouldn't exclude. So I'll exclude people who kind of are already on the team. Maybe they'll come and help out, but. Yeah, that's why I didn't say Thor yeah. either. I was, so, he's he's going to do his own thing. So I think. T'Challa, um, Spidey, Scarlet Witch. It's hard, Shoot. bro. Yeah. All right. Let me just name. Oh, Hulk. I think he's gonna. Yeah. Be, yeah he's gonna be in the team for sure. Um, who else? Oh, Captain Falcon. 
yeah, yeah I said I that, I said I that too. Yeah. I said that too. Sam. Oh, you know what? For ladies, I would, it'd be cool to see Sherry. Sherry on there. Oh, okay. The, yeah, yeah, sister. Yeah, sister. Because yeah, yeah. at one point, she does take up the Black Panther mantle, but I don't know if they're going to follow that storyline. But I would like to see her on there. Because, I mean, she fought in all of the battles that they had. Infinity War and... No, yeah, she had the little one. gloves. The little... She got pew, pew, pew. So, um, that was cool. So, I, so yeah, it would be T'Challa, Shuri, Spidey, Captain Falcon, Scarlet Witch, and Hulk. Well, what a team, dude. <laughs> oh, that'd be dope. And then, uh, whoever else is then in Captain Marvel on the side. Yeah, How about wait for who would be the... The leader? Yeah. Oh. Mm, that's Spider-Man's too young, bro. Yeah, he's, he's a kid. <laughs> he's, he's like a pre-Avenger. Like, he's just... Yeah. Done. T'Challa's too busy. Shuri is still so young as well. Um... Captain Falcon, bro. Yeah, it might be Sam. I think I could see him leading. I think following like in the footsteps of of Cap, I, I'll obviously become the new Captain America. I could see him leading this team. It's gonna. I think it's gonna take some time. Yeah. But I think that military experience, that whole experience, obviously with the war and everything, I think it's gonna be. I think it's gonna be good. So I could see them. So those would be my Avengers. Um. Oh well, they were already. So my next question was, who would be your leader or leaders? Yeah. Yeah, and that's it. Yeah. yeah. Um, I think maybe on the side, because you know how like there's still like F- Nick Fury and all these people yeah. side characters. So I could see Rhodey maybe not being an Avenger, but kind of being on the side as well. Like, oh, okay, uh, kind of like advising an advisor. I could see um, who else? Maybe Thor every now and then helping out again, like with the the Guardians. So yeah, I mean, in the leaders, I can I think it would be Sam and maybe T'Challa every now and then backing them up. Um, and oh, you know what? Maybe even Bucky might be in that group as well. Oh, I forgot about Bucky. Bucky, because I, I thought about. I don't know. Maybe he will be, but I could see him being. I, there. See, I see him or, more as a solo. Solo. Yeah, because I mean, he did have a line of story, a storyline in which he becomes a character known as White Wolf with his own suit oh, okay. in Wakanda. So it's him and it's him and T'Challa, kind of like. That's cool. Yeah, it's kind of cool. So, um, but yeah, that's that's all I have for the. For, I think that was that was, that was a good. What's the, what's the time on it? It's like an hour thirty. Yeah, Dang. Ooh, gonna... you, bro. <laughs> uh, I guess. I mean, anything else? Anything else you want to add? You know? Nah, this was a great movie. I loved yeah. it. I loved it. it. Sucks. <laughs> oh, could, oh, how about this? <laughs> I know it sucks. Like we at the end, but how about top? Do you want to do top three or top five what? for Marvel movies? Oh. For MCU movies? Top three. All right, let's do top three then. Dang. You go first. All right, I'll do my top five because I already top have them. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> So I'll do. Could have warned us about so, it. <laughs> no, no, because I thought about it even like in general. Like man, after I saw the second time, I'm like, where does this rank? Some people say Infinity War is better. Nah. I could see why. Yeah. Because of the impact it had and the way it was shot and written and just the way the ending itself is kind of like, oh, okay, they really just sucker punched us. Yeah. Um, but I think I've officially said that it's Endgame, Infinity War, Winter Soldier, which me has always been my number one for a long time. Civil War, and it's between Iron Man, mainly because it was the OG original one, yeah. first one, or Thor Ragnarok. So my oh, fifth will cool. always be fluctuating. That's funny. Yeah. yeah. For me, first one had to be Endgame, bro. It was just, I love the endings, mm-hmm. everything, bro, fine scenes. Uh, second, Captain America. Oh, the first event, the yeah, first the one? Yeah, the first Captain America. Okay. I, always, I always liked this story. Yeah, I recently saw it, and I remember seeing it in theater. I was kind of like, eh, you know, it's cool. But seeing it again, especially on the build-up, yeah. I was like, this is a great movie. It's, it's great. It's such a good movie. Like every I've always liked his storyline, bro. And then uh, third, Black Panther. Oh, how could I forget about Black Panther? <laughs> you know, I Black think it might Panther. be. It's between the fifth, <laughs> it's between Black Panther and those other two. Black amazing. Panther, fourth. If I have to have a fourth. And the fifth, fourth Iron Man, and then fifth. Damn, I had it and I lost it. Oh, uh, Ragnarok. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, those are good picks. Should we even ask that kid over there? She doesn't know any of them, bro. What <laughs> which are the ones that you have seen? I've seen like so you seen Endgame. She's seen like two, bro. You seen Infinity War? Oh, how did Ant Man? Oh, Ant Man. Ant Man and the Wasp. Ant Man. Ant Man. Dang. Uh. I'm in the Wasp, I think. Oh, okay. It's a little funny. Have you seen any of those? I'm in. Yeah, I'm in. Okay. Uh, have you seen Spider-Man Homecoming? Yes. The new one? I've seen all Spider-Man. 
Oh, but I mean the newer one in the MCU. MC. Okay. Um. You see? Oh, you saw Black Panther. Uh. <laughs> that's it. Those are the five. That's it. Did you ever see Iron Man, the first first one? I saw Captain America. Oh, Captain America. So, well, how would you rank those among those? Ba- um, based on what you remember from. Alright, do top three, yeah, do top three. Uh, well, yeah, because you only picked like four movies. <laughs> I picked six. I know it's a joke, but oh, whatever. Uh, she can count. I did. Endgame? Mm-hmm. So, Endgame number one. And I just it was good. <coughs> uh, it was okay, and I liked it. <laughs> Black okay, Black Panther second. anymore okay cool um wow so i mean this is it for i mean we still have spider-man far from home i mean it's still gonna be kind of bittersweet because we're like oh spider-man and then Tony! i'm gonna be crying in the audience even if it's the whole, whole movie is a happy go lucky i'm gonna cry um but yeah i mean anything else anything else you want to add on no i'm excited for spider-man to see how how he's doing yeah with and everything because it's five years place. later bro yeah or Oh, which, I mean, that we, well, that's what yeah. I think, you know. <laughs> yeah, so we'll Because if it is, that means, like, yeah. so, some of the kids <laughs> disappeared, bro. Yeah, disappeared. And now, I don't know. We'll see. I mean, if it's, you know, yeah. the, <laughs> we'll, see, we'll see. Yeah, we'll, we'll find out. <laughs> um, but no, I mean, if you haven't seen it and you, for some reason, listen to this podcast, um, you just spoil the whole movie. But go still watch it. It is Great. worth the watch. I've seen it three times. I might go again because it's just that good. And why not support this movie and potentially have it surpass Avatar's record, whatever setting amount of money that they made? Because uh, to be honest, I haven't even seen Avatar yet. I don't even know if it's that good. People said this. It is. Avatar, the one with the, the blue, people. blue people. Yeah. But I mean. I'm pretty sure it's going to pass. 10 years from now, like, are kids going to be talking about Avatar? Yo, what if they remake really them, bro? And they huh? have like they remake them, the heroes, you know, make a different Iron Man. It better be some forty X. I'd be like, ah, I've got to be in the movie. I don't think I'd be. Able to <laughs> I need to be uh, in Avenger. I need to be inside. Like, oh, I can feel when they I blast would watch me. Watch it. I'd be like, it's not Tony. Like, it's I don't like, think. <laughs> well, I I think I don't think they're gonna try to remake Iron Man, but I think they're gonna try to bring out different storylines. Yeah. Like maybe spin off movies. Yeah. Um, like for example, there's a character named Ironheart. Who's a girl who I think, if I'm correct, she won a scholarship, and then is as intelligent as Tony. And makes her own suit, so there's that, or her daughter as well, That'd maybe or cool. Pepper, maybe that they have their own cool. suit. So I mean, there's a lot they can do. Yeah. And me, maybe people want to see Cap again. It may not take place to the New Avengers, but maybe kind of because again, he has he started a whole new timeline because he went back in the past. Maybe we want to see. Oh, what did he do for those seventy years? Maybe there's an OG Avengers from the 1940s and 50s. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um. But that being said, as always, thank you guys for watching. What an episode. We're actually pretty organized. This was good. This might be a two-parter because I don't know if I want to do a whole episode and try to upload that. But yeah, we might split it up. What's the time again? Just to have an idea. An hour fifty. Oh, okay. That's that's I can split it up. So I mean, but that being said. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this very much. Um, but yeah, if you haven't, just go watch it. And if you can, run a whole MCU marathon. Or oh, not. That's a lot of time. That's 22 movies. That's like 59 that's hours, I think. Movies, that's a lot. So, but yeah, watch Endgame. But for sure, watch Infinity War before. So you kind of get the idea of what's going on. And But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. We'll be back soon. I don't even know what we're going to talk about because... I mean, what is it to talk about? I mean, I don't even know what's the point of living no more, dude. <laughs> this is my whole life, crying. dog. Just start crying again. No, but, but serious, on the serious note, go watch it. Enjoy it. It's an awesome movie. Support it. Help it break Avatar's record. Um, and I'm sure it probably will because people are still seeing it this weekend. And probably we'll see it the next weekend and the weekend after that. So, hope you guys enjoy it. As always, shout out to Zendaya. Shout out to Kira. On Zendaya. Can't wait to see the new Spider-Man movie. I'm excited. Um... <laughs> But as always, stay fat with a PH. God bless. And we'll catch you guys on the next episode. Goodbye, everybody.